I decided that I wanted to um, get into tintypes when I went to a photo festival in Brooklyn several years ago and there was a tintype booth. You know, it was, a, it was a very visceral reaction for me. I just couldn't believe it. I was holding a piece of metal that had my likeness on it in silver. I walked away from there and said to myself, I'm going to learn how to do this. As a photographer, uh, working for magazines and newspapers, I find that a lot of the images that I take end up, you know, on glossy magazine covers or so often my photos are taken and um, polished up and retouched. When you're using a tintype, that's just not possible. They're very, there's a raw nature to them, they're very honest, and I really was I really gravitated towards that. It's a very different way of shooting. Instead of the photographer just catching somebody or catching a moment, we're actually creating that moment, and I think that's really special. Having a tintype made is an experience. It is not um, an iPhone photo or a selfie. It's, it's not um, a bunch of pixels that end up hiding on your computer. It's essentially the opposite of digital to me. You can't get more real than a tintype.